again? Yeah. You Iowans changed history in the last judicial retention election. I've been all over the country. The National Organization for Marriage has helped in every state ballot initiative since 2007, from Proposition 8 to Maine, and now we have four states that are trying to, that are voting on marriage, and we're working in all these states to support marriage. But I'm here because Iowa is critical. I've traveled not only throughout the country, but throughout the world. I was in Scotland two months ago, and you may not believe this, but the folks in Scotland said, well, if the people of Iowa can defeat those judges, then we can get a vote and we can win a vote. So even in places like Scotland, people looked here. This, this, I want to be very clear here. This is after all of the elites, all of the elites said this could never be done. In the first judicial retention election, folks within the Beltway, within Washington, D.C., said, you know, no one, no one wins judicial retention. No one is able to take out judges in judicial and retention elections. Why are you going to do this? You won't be successful. But we have faith in the people of Iowa, and it is up to you to, again, change the course of history, take a bold stand, do not allow activist judges to rewrite your Constitution, hold them accountable, and the world will be watching, and we will do everything we can to help you. God bless you. God bless the great state of Iowa.